we will be reviewing the Slyk Giganotosaurus. And first off, I'll just give you a 360 view. Turn around, very nice head sculpt. And turn it the other way. It has a pretty sharp back. Oh, and also we will be reviewing the Slyk Tyrannosaurus Rex. It has a twisty tail. The color scheme is very, is very good too. And has sculpted feet, which is always nice. And its mouth also, also opens. Has a nice sculpt, has a tongue, and the roof of its mouth is sculpted. So it's the bottom. And you can shut it again. And it's just overall a very nice sculpt. It has lots of the wrinkle lines on it. And it, you can see it shows kind of the muscular, muscular part of it. And if you're wondering the price, I bought this for around $30. And now we'll move on to... Now we'll move on to the Tyrannosaurus Rex. Personally, this one is my favorite. It looks really good. It has... Also, it has a nice sculpt and whatnot. Under its feet are sculpted. Its head has a very nice sculpt. It looks it looks kind of like the T-Rex's head on Jurassic Park. Um, its mouth can also open. It's sculpted. It has sculpted roof of the mouth and bottom. Then you can shut it again. And it has very good details. Also, it has a muscular, muscular line, um, and it has these very nice details, like the eye. It is sculpted very well. It is sculpted and painted very well, both sides. And it um, also has very nice details, even on the feet. It has the... It has the little plates, and it is green. It has a very, very nice sculpt. Mm. And it has the extra claw kind of thing. Same, it has the very detailed wrinkles. And also the under its jaw. And for size comparison, I'll bring in the Chickenotosaurus. I just place them back here and him right here. They're pretty similar. The Chicanotosaurus is a little bit bigger. Just a little bit. And he also has a bulky head like the T-Rex has. And um the top has these has these ridges and stuff. It um uh, and it has the side gums, and this is even on the Giganotosaurus. Shut its mouth, and... Um, and he has a long, slender tail, like the Giganotosaurus. Giganotosaurus. And this guy was also $30, too. And then I'll give you a 360 view of him. His belly. And it has uh, muscular arms. Same with the chicken notosaurus. It has muscular arms. Um, and it also says Chiganotosaurus on the belly. It's like, um, 
and stuff. It's definitely worth your money paying for these. They are very good quality with all like the crease lines. The sculpted feet, you don't see that very often. It also has its um heads also sculpt their heads are also sculpted very well. Their claws were painted individually. Well, just judging on how good the paint job was. They might not have. It might have just been a really good job. A really good paint job. And the spikes are painted well, except there's just one glob of paint. That's not really a big deal. And it also has like a bluish purple. Sorry, I'm colorblind. But, yeah. And it has... And its tail can... um. Well, just, it's really amazing. Like, if this were a real dinosaur, it would probably have these crease lines here and here. And whatnot, <laughs> judging by the position of the, ta of, of the tail. And it also has the nice, um, holes in the skull. Well, like, what, what would have been the holes in the skull? Um, and it also has those... On both sides and they're nice and even so one's not like one's not way bigger than the other they're not 100 percent even but that's the most realistic i would i would say you should if you're gonna get dinosaur toys or you're gonna get a dinosaur toy get slick dinosaurs they're less than papo but they're just as good as papo like the skin details it has scales and stuff and look at this t-rex they are just absolutely beautiful um nice green you can see where its spine would be also on here it's slender you can see what you can notice saurus would have looked like its tail is nice, <clears throat> and, um, its arms are nice. The arms, I'd have to say, are a little bit cartoony. Well, just, like, the arms look a little bit small. Because they're the same size as the T-Rexes. Their arms are pretty much the same size. But, um, I'm really sorry because it's, um, oh, my stand just um, went off. Um, yeah, so. The Giganotosaurus and Slake Dinosaurs are very good, and I definitely recommend you, I definitely recommend you get them. And as always, goodbye.